Hello, my fellow investors. Here's a clip of Walter Schloss uh, predicting the next Tesla, and I'll give you my takeaway from this clip after you finish watching the clip. What you try to do is to keep your emotions out of investing, and you try to look at the thing logically, not the way you want to have it. Uh, I think that, for instance, um, the getting electric cars uh, would be a great idea. Uh, but they don't seem to have made them in such a way that you don't need gasoline. Someday somebody's going to invent it, and then it's going to be a big hit. But I don't feel comfortable buying, say, an automobile company because at some future time somebody's going to invent something that'll make it better. I'd rather buy the things the way they are rather than the way you think they may be at a later date. So what I want to bring out of this video is that take someone like Walter Schloss. He's a classical Benjamin Graham cigar boat kind of investor. He worked for Benjamin Graham. He's a great friend of Warren Buffett. His whole investing career was cigar butts. It's not that they didn't understand what a growth company is or what's the potential. It's not that. It just it wasn't in their circle of competence. They liked a certain kind of investing to buy um, things that you know your risk is very low and you have here an easy, um, let's say, call it a, one bag or two bag or ten bag or whatever it is. It's not that they didn't understand growth. It's just they weren't comfortable investing in such kinds of stocks, in such kinds of investments. But they knew very, very good what these kind of stocks and what these kind of companies are. And you can see here, he's predicting way before he said it's going to be a big hit. But he's not comfortable investing in such kinds of stocks. Thank you very much and I hope you enjoyed this video. Now, if you like this video, don't forget to smash the like button and to subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much.